I know some of you have shown interest in my big fish nets. So here is a video about them. What I'm going to do, I'm going to show video clips of me netting fish with each of these nets, and then I'm going to talk about them. The two nets that I have is a monster rod holders net and a savage gear folding net. And as you can tell, each net can net big fish, even the savage gear net. The first net I'm going to talk about is the monster rod holders net. In this quick clip, I'm in a little boat with my buddy on a big lake, and we managed to catch a really nice catfish. Oh. oh, this is a big one, I think. Oh. Here comes your 30 seconds of chaos, huh? Yeah, keep, keep reeling that one in all the way. This one might be bigger than I thought it was. It's still just a slack line. Yeah, just keep. Look at that, he's just sucking to the bottom. Here, trade places. There he is. We might have a 30 pounder. Uh, yeah, might as well. Look at that. Oh yeah. Might as well use the net on him head first. So I gotta get him head first. Got him! <laughs> nice. Now, now take the net straight up and down and pull it straight up and over. That's a nice fish. Just right under here? Yeah, just right under the mat. Oh, uh, this is a good way to end the day. Let me get the hook out. We're we'll weighing in the net. Use the grips on him, he's a little bit too big for grips. Ooh, 34. Okay, 30 pounder. Okay. He had a lot of life in him. There he goes. Now, this monster rod holder's net is a Hydro Web HD80. I know they have a bigger one, but this one is the perfect size one for my boat. The bigger one is just a little bit too big for my boat. This net has a little measurement up to 36 inches on the handle. And when you remove this cap and press the button in, you can remove the handle from the net. That way you can put the catfish in the net or whatever fish you catch and weigh it. The upper part of the net only weighs a pound. And it's a telescoping net, which means easy storage by putting the handle into the net. The net itself is rubber coated so it helps keep the fish from getting damaged. And mine still has the Made in USA tag on it. So Steve Douglas, the catfish dude, who is the owner of Monster Rod Holders, has these nets made in the US. I actually bought this at the catfish conference for $100. I think it costs a little bit more on the Monster Rod Holders website. I've been to every single catfish conference that they've ever had, including the first one that was inside the Jeff Jones Marine building. And we were packed in there like sardines in a can. Now this is the Savage Gear telescoping folding net. Now I actually don't have any good clips of me netting fish with this. And this first clip is the actual first fish that I got to net in this net. Got it. I'm going to have to go off camera to net this guy. He's gone into the weeds over here. The carp. <laughs> He's in the weeds. Well, at least I brought my Savage Gear net this time. This is a nice fat carp.
Now here's a quick bonus clip of a big carp that I caught and got to net with this net at one of my favorite carp spots. There he goes. No, 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 I don't want you going over there. <laughs> They're all running towards the wood. actually bigger than small. This is a nice size one. There we go. This is a nice carp. There he goes. Now this net is unique. I bought it at Harris Sports Mail and they are located in Europe. The net cost me about $40 and the shipping cost me about $50. So this net cost about the same as the monster rod holders net. Now this net has a few unique features. I can actually increase its length to net something way out in the water. Most of the time I just keep it like this. I can also fold the net, which makes storage really, really convenient. You can also use this as a basket for the fish. I keep this on my boat at all times because it's so compact. You never know when you catch a 40 pound flathead catfish when you're crappie fishing. The net on this is also rubberized so it helps keep from damaging the fish. This net does feel a little bit weaker than the monster rod holders net. So I wouldn't really want to net a 50, 60 pound catfish in this unless this is the only net that I have with me. So be sure to leave some comments below. What do you guys think about these two nets? And do you have any experience with either one of them? I know the Monster Rod Holders net is a pretty popular net. A lot of people have it. And this Savage Gear net is popular in Europe. I really wish they would bring it over to the United States. Because it's a decent net for pike and muskie easily. These are definitely two nice nets. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.